What we're going to do today is show you how to measure sway bar diameters. If you need to replace sway bar bushings, the first question you'll be asked is what size is the sway bar on your car? Whether it's a factory sway bar or whether it's an aftermarket sway bar, you do need to get the diameter correct. What you want to do when you measure a sway bar is always measure in a straight segment. Never measure it on curves or at ends. The material is distorted at this point. And what we're going to do is measure it right in the center of each one of these bars. And what we're going to use is just some tools that you might have around the house. We have a metric ruler, and then we also have a crescent wrench. In a minute, we'll show you how to do it. Now, to measure the bar, keep in mind that there is some powder coating on the bar that will make up for a little bit of thickness. And the instruments we're using here are obviously not that accurate. It will give you an idea of what diameter bars you have within a millimeter, and you should be able to get a new set of bushings for that or get bushing uh, urethane bushing replacements. So what you're going to do is you're going to take the crescent wrench and put it over the bar in a straight section, not on any of the curves. You'll take that off and what you're going to do is then slip it over your ruler and take a measurement on the metric side if you're dealing with an import car. If you're dealing with a domestic vehicle, you're going to probably want to do it on the, on the inch side of the ruler. And there you go.